What's happening everyone, my name is Alex and welcome back! In today's video we are checking out some of the latest wireless earbuds from Tozo. The ones that I have here today are called the NC7. Now you can find these earbuds for about 50 bucks or just under 50 bucks depending when and where you buy them from. And for that price they do offer some impressive things. So first of all these have active noise cancellation, we also have a transparency mode, so that mode that you use if you don't actually hear what's happening around you. These also offer an IPX6 rating, so it doesn't matter if you're sweating, it doesn't matter if it's raining whenever you're wearing this, nothing will happen to them. And we also get up to 72 hours of listening time on one charge, of course between the case and the actual earbuds. Not to mention the sound quality that we get from these, even though these are quite affordable, is probably one of the best that I heard in quite some time. Well, of course we are talking about budget friendly wireless earbuds. So I can probably go as far as saying right at the beginning of this video that these um, wireless earbuds are some of the best budget friendly earbuds that I got to try up until now. Alright, so we are starting the very quick unboxing, the earbuds come in this box right here, a good looking box. Inside the box you're gonna find the user manual, however the earbuds are actually super easy to use so you may not necessarily need this user manual. Basically after you pair them to your phone for the first time, all you have to do is open the case and put them in your ears. By the time you actually put them in your ears they will be connected to your phone so you don't actually have to do anything. When you're done with them you just put them back in the case and you close the case and they will turn themselves some off and of course they're gonna start charging from um, the little charging case. So between the earbuds and the charging case you get up to 72 hours of listening time. On the earbuds themselves you get up to 18 hours of listening time, of course that really depends if you're using the active noise cancellation or not. And charging this takes about um, 2 hours, so you can charge this either through the USB-C port that we have on the back here or you can actually place this on a wireless charger. So this supports wireless charging as well, which is very good because for this price range you don't typically see that with too many earbuds. The charging case is very tiny and also very light. This is mostly made out of um, plastic on the front here. We have four LEDs that will basically show you how much battery the charging case um, has. And the earbuds aren't gonna fall off um, if you open the charging case, so they do stay in there with a little magnet. I'll show you that little magnet um, in just um, a bit. Aside from that in the box you're also gonna find a USB-A to a USB-C charging cable so you can charge that um, little charging case and we also have some replacement um, ear tips. Now the ear tips that come um, pre-installed on um, the earbuds are the medium size I believe and these ones work great for me but of course you have smaller or larger ear tips so if you wanna change them um, they're gonna be in the box there. Taking a quick look at the earbuds themselves, of course these ones are pretty tiny since that charging case is pretty tiny of course um, you could expect that these um, would be pretty small as well. So these are mostly made out of um, plastic, they don't look bad um, by any means. On the bottom here, if we can call this the bottom, we have that little magnet that I mentioned earlier. So you can actually see that other magnet inside the charging case here. So that's how they actually stay in the charging case so they don't um, fall off. We also have the charging contacts right there and these also have an optical sensor as well. So basically every time you take these out of your ear the music will pause. When you put them back on the music will start again or the same if you're watching a movie or something like that. When you take them out uh, that movie will be paused and when you put them back on um, the movie will start again. So this is a great feature, I've seen this for more expensive earbuds in the past but typically the budget friendly earbuds don't have this feature. Of course these have a variety of microphones on them, first of all those microphones are used for the active noise cancellation and also whenever you are making phone calls with the earbuds. And next I want to show you a quick uh, recording that I've done just so you can hear how the microphones on these um, actually capture sound. So let's say that you're having a conversation on the phone with someone, I'm basically gonna show you how that conversation would sound. So I'm gonna use the video from the camera but I will use uh, the sound from these uh, microphones. So let me play that for you and I will be right back. Alright, so now we are recording the sound from the internal microphones inside the Tozo NC7. So of course I'm in the exact same place where I was before so it's super quiet out here so you shouldn't hear anything else aside from my voice. I'm also recording this sound on my iPhone. So basically I'll take the sound from here and I'll sync that um, with the video. So you're basically gonna hear the sound from the wireless earbuds and see the video from the camera. So this is how the internal microphones on these two earbuds would capture sound. So this is how they would sound if you're having a conversation with someone. 
Going back to our earbuds, the top side of each earbud is actually a touch button, touch surface, let's call it so. The preset touch controls are in the user manual. However, if you do install the Tozo app on your smartphone, the app is available for iOS and Android, you can actually customize what the tapping does on each earbud. So very important because with a lot of these cheaper, budget-friendly earbuds, basically you don't get an app or any customization option. Well, with these ones, you can actually customize what the tapping on each earbud does. Since we are talking about the app, of course, from the app there, you can turn on or off the active noise cancellation. You can turn on or off the transparency mode. There are other modes that you can choose from. And very importantly, and a feature that you don't actually typically see for budget-friendly earbuds is the ability to customize the sound exactly how you want it. So there are some preset sounds in there, but if you want to customize the sound to your needs, likes, etc. You can actually do that from the app. So very nice to see that on a budget-friendly pair of wireless earbuds. Inside these, we also have seven millimeter drivers. And I know that doesn't sound impressive on paper, but when you actually listen to these, you're gonna be impressed by the amount of bass that we actually get from those seven millimeter drivers. So as I said at the beginning of the video, the audio quality that you're gonna get from this is better than pretty much anything else at this price range. So they also get quite loud. So I can't really say anything bad about the sound quality that we get from these ones. Quite impressive, I'm gonna say. The active noise cancellation also works quite good. Of course, this is not the best that I've heard, but at this price range, it is impressively good as well. And the transparency mode also works good as well. So again, for the price, these are pretty much unbeatable. These also use Bluetooth 5.3 and I haven't had any connectivity issues. So I can basically leave my phone here and go anywhere in the apartment here and they will not get disconnected from the phone. So no issues with that. As for latency, I watched the YouTube app and I've uh, tried Netflix with them on and it, there doesn't seem to be any lag from the time you actually see the image and the time that you actually hear um, the sound. Now for gaming, I wouldn't exactly use this. There is a bit of latency if you're playing certain games. So I would use this for music and basically watching TV shows or whatever videos you're watching online, but I wouldn't necessarily use them for gaming. So to quickly conclude this video, if you're looking for an affordable pair of wireless earbuds, the Tozo NC7 here are definitely the ones that you should go for. You can't really go wrong with these earbuds for their price. The sound quality that you get from them is way better than I ever imagined. The battery life on them is really good. We also get an IPX6 rating, wireless charging. So these earbuds are quite impressive for their price. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.